Commonly we'll see that uh, an ITB cell has multiple different business systems. Um, they don't all talk to each other, so there'll be a separate CRM, separate ERP, separate e-commerce, perhaps, or a, um, uh, a service management or ticketing system. Uh, they don't talk to each other particularly well. Um, if, you know, if they are integrated, those integrations are a point of failure typically, or certainly a risk. Um, each of those systems will be on a different upgrade path, so people do get version locked on an on, on older version, or, or older kind of legacy software. What we also see amongst those systems is they may have had some um, bespoke development done, which, which it further kind of compounds the problem of upgrades, so upgrades become quite costly and expensive, require a lot of testing and are quite, quite difficult to do. Um, with um, Interact built on NetSuite, uh, those problems vanish. It's one system, so there's, there are no integrations going on. I think it's just one system. Um, the upgrades are automatic, so uh, twice a year the system gets upgraded, um, and there's very little testing needs to be done throughout that, that upgrade process. Um, and Interact has uh, built for NetSuite accreditation, which means that we, as, as, as Nolan, as partners, we have to test Interact to support those upgrades as well twice a year.